Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem and here uh, we have the nice algebraic expression. So we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form. So here first uh, we uh, rewrite this algebraic expression as here you see that the base is 4 and we write our base as 2 square and its exponent is 11 minus 2. So here we use the nice exponential law and you know about this law if we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m times of n. Here we use this nice exponential law on the first term so here we multiply these two terms and we write it as 2 to the power of 22 minus 2. And now in the next step here we break this exponent and we write this uh, 22 as 2 to the power of 21 plus 1 minus 2. And here we use another exponential law. We know that if we have a to the power of m plus n, it is written as a to the power of m into a to the power of n. So according to this exponential law, we write uh, this term as 2 to the power of 21 into 2 to the power of 1 minus 2. Now you focus on these terms, you see here we have 2 be the common term, so that we take common 2 and the remaining terms are 2 to the power of 21 minus 1, okay. So in the next step, we focus on this term and in this term we have 2 to the power of 21, so here we again break this exponent 21 and we write this 21 as 3 times of 7 minus 1, okay. So further uh, in the next step. Here we use another exponential law. If we have a to the power of m times of n, it is equals to a to the power of m into a to the power of n. So here we use this nice uh, exponential law. So uh, according to this exponential law, we break this exponent in this form 2 into uh, 2 into uh, we write this as 2 to the power of 7 into 3 and minus 1. So here we uh, rewrite this uh, term as uh, a to the power of m to the power of n. Okay. So that uh, so uh, after this step uh, here we have uh, sorry we cannot uh, use these value here we just directly write uh, this term to the this term. So this is uh, right here mistakenly. So now in the next step uh, you uh, see here uh, yeah, we know uh, we easily find the value of 2 to the power of 7 we know that 2 to the power of 7 equals to 128 cubed and we write this one as uh, 1 cubed okay so here uh, we need uh, to use the nice cubic formula you know about this formula if we have a cubed minus b cubed it is equals to a minus b times of uh, a square plus a b plus b square so we use this nice formula so here you have the value of a is 128 and the value of b is 1 so now we substitute these two values of a and b in the below cubic formula so according to this formula we write the above expression as so first we have a minus b so our a is 128 minus b is 1 into a square so a is 128 square plus a b a b is 128 and b is 1 plus b square is 1 square so here we need some simplification and we write it as two times of here when we subtract these two values you get 127 into uh, here we write this 128 square as 100 plus 28 square okay we break this 128 as 100 plus 28 and its whole square so when you multiply 128 by 1 you get 128 plus 1 square equals to 1 so now in the next step uh, here we we just easily multiply these two terms by traditional multiplication so in this question we cannot uh, use the calculator okay so here calculator is not allowed so when you multiply these two times of 127 then you get here 254 into uh, here uh, we need an other square identity so you know about this identity as well we have a square plus uh, a plus b whole square okay if you have a plus b whole square it is equals to 
a square plus two times of a b plus b square so here we use this nice uh, square identity to the above uh, term uh, so here you have this is our a and this is our b so now we apply this formula on this term and it is written as 100 square plus 28 square plus 2 times of 100 into 28 plus this is 128 plus 1 equals to 129. So in the next step uh, here we need more simplifications and we write it as 254 into so here you write this 100 as 10 square and its whole square plus here we again break this 28 as 20 plus 8 square plus here when you multiply 2 times of 28 when you multiply 2 times of 28 then you get 56 multiplied by 100 we know that 56 times of 100 equals to 5600 so we write this expression is equals to 5600 okay so we replace uh, this term by 5600 and you get 5600 plus 129 so here you see that we have 254 into this uh, here you multiply these two exponents and you get 10 to the power of 4 plus here we again use uh, this nice square identity on this term and it is written as 20 square plus 8 square plus 2 times of 20 into 8 and plus 5600 and plus 129 so here we need uh, some simplifications uh, here we just add uh, the like terms and we have uh, 254 into 10 to the power of 4 plus here you see that uh, we easily get uh, the square of uh, 20 okay you easily get the square of 20 by the traditional uh, way uh, so the 20 square equals to 400 and 8 square equals to 64 and uh, when you multiply 2 times of 20 you get uh, 40 and 40 times of 8 is equals to 320 and when we add these two numbers uh, then you easily get the value is 5729. So now here we add the uh, all these terms here we sum up all of these terms and you will get its output in this form 254 into 10 to the power of 4 plus when you add all of these terms this is a very simple addition you can easily uh, add all of these terms without the calculator okay so uh, you get here uh, 6530 okay so now we uh, we just break this 10 to the power of 4 and uh, now we focus on 10 to the power of 4 and it is written as 254 into here we write this term as uh, 10 and its whole uh, power 4 and plus this is 6513 so now we multiply this uh, 2 to the power 54 by this term and it is written as 2 uh, when you multiply 254 by this term then you get here 254 and 4 times of 0 plus when you multiply this term with this term then you get its output is 1654302 so here uh, by uh, the uh, additional uh, traditional addition you easily add these terms and you get here 4194302 this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos